So how did the concept of the robot come about? So we, <coughs> sorry, the excitement of the Maker Faire. <laughs> so uh, we always wanted to have an educational robot and then we met with this group of uh, young robot makers from Spain, Complobot, and David uh, and I thought it would be good to transform their work into an educational robot for all kids. Involved in the, the development of the robots. Can you tell us a bit more about that? Yeah, sure. I mean, um, the thing is, like the, these guys, they, they usually go into this competition called the the Robot Cup, that, that takes about a year to produce a robot, and it's very, very expensive. So what we did was to take their work with them in, in getting their know-how and making a, an easy to use and easy to start with robots. You know, the, the concept in Arduino is that if the knowledge is like a staircase, like this, like. We first need to know physics and math and electronics and mechanics. What we try to do is to, we put you up here in the staircase, we take an elevator, so to say, and then we just help people to go into deeper levels of knowledge by experimenting and having fun while trying. So we've made, I've made five exclusive video tutorials with Arduino. Can you give us um, a, an overview of what we're going to see in those five videos? Oh, sure. I mean, in those videos you will see uh, Jun Jan, our collaborator in Malmo, and myself, explaining different tutorials about from how to unbox a robot when it comes in your package, but also how you can make your robot follow a line, how you can make your robot play music, uh, how you can make your robot uh, do some kind of rescue activities like look for objects and uh, carry them with it and so on. So the, the video tutorials are really step-by-step -step guides to examples that come on the Arduino IDE to be used specifically with the robot. And they will guide you in what we call the exploration phase to get you excited and try out things, plug small sensors, and then continue building on top. Wonderful. So excited to see those over the next few weeks. Finally, uh, Massimo, the Maker Faire is really exciting. It's a real buzz here today. I know you've lost your voice because you're so excited about it. But in a couple of sentences, can you tell us why it's important that companies like RS Components come to the Maker Faire and support um, and what they give to, to the people here, visitors here today? Yes, we were trying to create an event for the whole of Europe. Companies like RS are in every country. So it's important that we create these occasions for all the makers in Europe to get together. And, and, and RS provide the tools for this maker to be created. So I think it's a very good match. Wonderful. Thanks, guys. I'm wishing you a great maker fair. Yeah. Thank you very much.